Six missionaries for the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints are safe tonight after being held at gunpoint last night. Police say 45-year-old Paul Marquez was intoxicated when he invited them into his home at Windsor Mobile Estates. ABC4's Rosie Nguyen explains how the missionaries got out of this terrifying situation. We talked to a man who says his brother owns this mobile home where Paul Marquez lives and where the incident happened last night. He didn't want to go on camera, but tells us Marquez has a troubled past and he didn't feel safe knowing his brother was living with Marquez. It may be a case of good instinct. Two missionaries with the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints asked four of their fellow missionaries to accompany them to an appointment with 45-year-old Paul Marquez. They say he was intoxicated when he invited them in. The gentleman became very erratic, uh, produced a firearm, and uh, pointed the firearm at the missionaries and, and threatened them and uh, held them there. My understanding is he held them there for about an hour. The missionaries say they were able to talk their way out and convince Marquez to let them leave. That's when they called police. In my opinion, they were able to get out. They handled it very, very well, whether it was because of, uh, because of this person remaining uh, somewhat calm. Johnson says Marquez is legally restricted from having a gun. Police found two additional guns after searching his home. Marquez is currently being held at the Salt Lake County Jail and faces multiple charges, including six counts of kidnapping and aggravated assault. Reporting in West Valley City, Rosie Nguyen, ABC4 News. All right, Rosie, thank you very much. A spokesperson with the church telling us they are now working with those missionaries to provide any needed support and counseling as they recover from this incident. But we're glad they are okay.